Edgar Wright. Edgar Wright. You Edgar are an enormous Wright. fan of the Cornetto trilogy. I love... Aren't yes. you? Yes, I do. So Edgar Wright, obviously... That's because I'm a massive fan of Simon Pegg. You're not. And, and Edgar Wright was his sort of... His, his buddy yeah, in arms for many of those love early him. years. Love the lead. Love the lead. Um, Edgar Wright was also a uh, made Baby Driver. Which you yes, was one of your I absolute all time favourites, wasn't that. it? Um, and he was initially employed by Marvel to star Ant Man, but left oh, due yeah, to creative differences. Saying. Do you remember that? So, this is Edgar Wright's latest new film. It stars Anya Taylor Joy, oh. Thomasina Mikkel, Mikkel, Mikkelson, or whatever her name is, from um, uh, Jojo Rabbit, I think. So, you know, Thomasina, oh, the, yeah, the girl. The girl yeah. It's set in 60s Soho, it's set in the fashion oh. world. Um, from photos I've seen of it, I'm getting a few kind of in fabric vibes. Did you see in fabric? I didn't mean, see in no, fabric. It's a bit weird. But... A lot of sex in it and a lot of strange shit. Yeah, I do remember you telling me. That. But this is a sort of time travel, back in time, Soho 60s, twisted oh, it's a time psychological travel, horror. In some way, yeah. I'm not going to lie, I always have problems with time so traveling I. things. I always feel like they're a bit corny. Yeah, I always feel like they need to do something better than just like a really funky edit. Yeah. Yeah, or a kind of and yeah. all that kind of shit. Uh, Why does my hair look so like? It's so curly. And long. It's so yeah. curly and long. So Anya Taylor Joy is in it. Mm -hmm. um, and as I say, Thomasine McKenzie. Thomasine oh. McKenzie. And Matt Smith is in it as well. So, uh, you know, quite a cast. I, oh, Matt Smith? If I'm getting anything from this. Doctor, Doctor. I do like the quality of his films. I do like the way he shoots stuff. I like there's a nice quality, yeah, I you know. I mean, I'm not as but much I of a fan. I would agree with this first time I would agree with Nan. I, I feel like sometimes don't quite know how to end his films. Ah, interesting point. Well, I wonder how he's going to start good. and end this one. Yes. Um, so let's have a look. Let's go Let's go on a deep dive into Soho, which I have spent many years and was probably single-handedly the one square mile that really did a lot of damage to my depression yes. and allowed me to double down on my deep, deep addictions. So it's not necessarily a great place, it's but not... it, it's a place that I, I, I've been to a lot and I know well. So let's go back. When you're alone and life is making you lonely, you can always go down, down. When you've got troubles, all the noise and the hurry seems to help, I know. Down, down. Yeah, I like the look of it. Like the sound mix. Just listen to the music of the traffic in the city. Oh, wow, look at that. She's in the 60s. Linger on the oh, sidewalks where the neon signs are pretty. How can you lose? Okay, so he's just flashed back. There's no fancy. Oh. Is that the mirror? Oh my god. Ooh. I like the music. Oh, I do. It's getting dark, twisted now. It's getting more manner. The light. Are much brighter there. You can forget all your troubles, forget all your cares. So go downtown. Things will be great when you're downtown. No fun things for sure. Downtown. Cinematography and the colours. I love a bit of neon. I love a bit of neon, me. Love a bit, a bit of cracked neon. Love a bit of neon and um, rubbed off makeup. 
Rubbed off makeup looks makeup. great. <laughs> makeup rubbed off. Rubbed off makeup. I, I like smudged makeup. I like the way it was an unfurling sense of doom, wasn't it? It was yes. an increasing sense of, ugh. And, and I like that we don't really know what the fuck's going on. <laughs> yeah, we've got the way. yeah, exactly. We've got the double life. We've got the reflections. I also like the fact that he's obviously going for that sort of the showbiz glamour so, but he's going for that seedy underbelly. Yeah, and I believe, that's what I liked about it. I believed the, um, the uh, what would you call it? Like the, the sets and everything, yeah, like it was design. very good with it, with the time. Production and design. Oh yes, yes, it's sense of era and time. Yeah, because that's sometimes real. I worry with like um, yeah. time travel and stuff. You just can tell that they've only <laughs> made it up for where the camera's filming it, but it looked like all of it. And I like the fact that it was exploring those kind of B movie t t techniques of like hands coming through walls, yeah, like yeah, repulsion yeah. And, and, the and the crack, the face and the, freeze in the frame. Knife yeah, I love reflection. That, shit. that looks good. I like it. Look at that. We're going to go and see that last night in, in Soho. Last night in Soho. Last, last night in Soho. For more film and family fun, don't forget to click the subscribe button and make sure to click the bell to never miss an update.